Hi, it's August the 28th, 2019. This is Dr. Wes Fryer, and I'm going to share a quick demo of a free application for your iPhone called Voice Record Pro and how you can use that to create a very simple, no edit podcast or radio show. So you're going to want to search the App Store to find this app. Again, it is called Voice Record Pro, and even though it says Pro, it is free, and you're going to install that on your iPhone. Once you have it open, uh, there's really just two steps to record. You're going to press the red record button, and then you are going to press at the top where it says start in the upper right corner. Now, of course, before you do this, you want to go ahead and have your plan. I would recommend turning your phone on to airplane mode, and that way if you get a call or a text message, that's not going to interrupt your recording. But um, and of course, you want to make sure your device is charged so that it doesn't you know, run out of battery as you are recording. Uh, but once you press start, it is going to start recording. So here we are doing our test recording on Voice Record Pro. There is a pause button at the bottom, or I can simply press stop when I'm done. And ideally, you want to not have to make any kind of edits at all to your uh, recording. Um, there are some advanced features. Now, I've reduced the number of options that are visible here. You can click up here and choose to turn things on or off. Um, the main ones that you'll probably want to use are either uh, saved to Google Drive. You can actually move those kinds of things up. Um, or actually what I'm going to do here is just to save in a photo album because then I can send it from my photo album wherever I want. Um, so the other thing that you might want to do, um, and like I said, there's advanced stuff you can do with trimming and, and editing and things like that, um, but you might just uh, change the title. And so I will tap here and I'll say, you know, this was our podcast test. And the reason for changing that name is that when I save it to the photo album, and this is one of the most wonderful things about this free app, is that even though this is an audio file, it will save like a video. I have some different templates and I can flip through these. And if I don't want to put a picture in, I can just have my title there and my date and time. Um, if I wanted to put notes in, I could type those or I can copy and paste those. But maybe you do want to have a picture. So let me cancel this. And I'm going to tap the camera icon there in the upper right corner and then go to my albums. And so now I can choose a photo. So let's say I was doing a, a little podcast about the storm that we had this week, and there's a little radar uh, image. And so now that picture is going to be in or available uh, to be saved in this photo album. So now you can see it there. That's template 14. That's just the picture. So if I wanted my title at the top or if I wanted the title, I think I'll actually, um, let's see, you can choose whether or not you want the icon there. And then I think, yeah, it can be at the top or the bottom. So, hey, how about that? Podcast test gives the date, time, and has a little voice record pro icon. Uh, again, it's up to you. Uh, but when I click continue here, that is now being saved into my photo album. So I'm going to press my home button. I'm going to open up my photos. And when I take a look, here is my actual recording. And so I can go ahead and play that. It is going to start recording. So And I won't play the whole thing. Um, but it's there and it's in my photo roll. So the process from here is to go ahead and, and uh, tap your share square. And that's actually, yeah, I wasn't showing there. So there's a, a share square there in the bottom right corner. And now you can choose where you would like to send this. So if you are using Google Classroom, you can turn that on. You can actually reorder these things. And so I'm, I'm going to choose to go ahead and just send this to Google Classroom. I could also find Google Drive and I can send it there. And that's how I can turn in this project as a video. So that has been a quick little demo for you of a wonderful app that again is called Voice Record Pro. If you would like to have more information about creating media like this, you can visit my website showwithmedia.com where I've got a, a series of different products and this one I call a radio show or a podcast. I'll be putting these resources here on this page. And if you have questions or want to reach out to me, the easiest way to do that is by visiting Twitter. And I am W Fryer on Twitter. If you are not on Twitter, you can find me by going to westfryer.com, clicking the contact link, and I've got an electronic 
contact form there. So I hope that has been helpful to you and thank you for listening.